Thousands of volunteers in our region are taking part today in the King Day of Service, rolling up their sleeves and pitching in to make our neighborhoods and communities stronger. I would use reporter Jasmine Payute joining us now from Girard College this afternoon with more. Jasmine. Janelle, good afternoon. Currently on its 27th year, this MLK Day of Service is considered one of the oldest and largest in the country. The theme this year, combating racism and building community. Now take a look inside. This is the 13th year that this is being held at Girard College. The event honors Dr. King's legacy by transforming the national holiday into a day of citizen action. This year, that included free COVID-19 testing led by the Black Doctors COVID-19 Consortium free adult and children's vaccine clinics, distribution of PPE, as well as educational activities and voter registration. People involved say events like these help bridge gaps. Our community vaccination program really is focused on being in communities where there's um, historically poor access to health care, have had poor access to vaccinations, have had lower uptake of vaccines, to be able to partner with um, community partners that people trust, um, be in that space where people know how to get there, it's easy for them to get there, um, and, uh, and, and be available with both the vaccine and education information that people might need. At 3 o'clock this afternoon, there will be a virtual discussion on Dr. King's legacy featuring U.S. Senator Bob Casey and others. We'll have a link to that on our website, cbsphilly.com. We're live at Gerard College. Jasmine Payute, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Thank you, Jasmine.